All right, which one are we doing now? This is exercise 10, right? Yes. Exercise 10? Yeah, with the giraffe. Page 129. Page 129. Okay. Page 129, exercise 10. Okay. It says the head of a giraffe is two meters above its heart. So the neck of a giraffe is about six, six feet, seven feet, six and a half feet long. The head of the giraffe is two meters above its heart, and the density of the blood, the density of the blood is 1.05, 1 1.05 times 10 to the third kilograms per cubic centimeter, right? Which is the same thing as 1,050, correct? Yeah. Right? All right? Now, now. What is the difference in pressure between the giraffe's heart and head? What is the difference in pressure? Now, are you ready for this? Pressure of a fluid. Pressure of a fluid is only dependent upon three things. Pressure of a fluid is only dependent upon three things. The density, the acceleration due to gravity, and the height of the fluid. Are you ready? Shall I repeat that? Mm -hmm. The density of a fluid is only dependent upon three things. Density of the fluid, the acceleration due to gravity, and the height of the fluid column. Rho G H. The pressure of a fluid is dependent upon the density, acceleration due to gravity, and the height of the column. So, <clears throat> it would be, let's, let's leave this on. Let's leave this on and do this all in one shot. So it's going to be right here. It's going to be pressure equals pressure difference, P, okay, equals, I'm going to solve for Pascal's. A newton is the unit label for force, right? Watt is the unit label for power. Watt. Watt, exactly watt. Kilogram is the unit label for mass, correct? Pascal, a pascal is the unit label for pressure. Newtons per square meter is a pascal. So we will solve for pascals, clear? And if you multiply the density of the substance times the g, times the height of the column, that's going to equal the pressure, clear? And pressure is newtons per square meter. Understood? So it'll be, it'll be right here. I'll leave off the unit labels. Is that okay? It makes it cleaner. As long as you're only using meters, seconds, seconds, meters, kilograms, nothing else, right? Okay. So it's going to be 1,050 times 10. They're very goofy today, and that's okay. Okay. <laughs> and then times two. You get that? 1,050 times 10 times two. 1,050 times 10, 21,000. 21,000. So P difference equals 21,000 what? Pascals. 21,000 what? Pascals. Pascals, right? 21,000. Pascal's. Clear? Yeah. Before I quit this particular problem, let's do a dimensional analysis. This is actually dimensional analysis. I want to show you that a Pascal is actually Newton per square meter, and that if I multiply the density times the mass, times the accelerated due to gravity, times the height, that's going to equal a Pascal. Clear? 
So I'm going to erase all this, okay? Okay, and then we're going to quit for the day. All right, you ready? Yeah. All right, so if I take, if I take, if I take kilograms per cubic centimeter, right? Per cubic meter, right? Yeah. That's the, remember, pressure equals density, density GH, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's density, right? Right? That's density, gentlemen. Yeah. That's density, right? Times, let's just do it this way, times meters, sorry, kilogram, yeah, times, times meters per second squared, correct? Yes? Yeah. Times, times what? Times meters, right? Yeah. You all right with that? Yeah. Okay. This meter here cancels with that meter, and you're left with squared meter, correct? Kilogram meters per second squared is actually a newton, right? So this is going to be newton. This part here is going to be newton, and then you're left with meter squared here. Jack. You don't have to. You don't have to. That doesn't have to cancel. You could cancel this one instead of this one if you like. It doesn't matter. But the point is that you have meter and meter here, but you're just going to cancel one of them out. So you see where this is actually, this is actually dimensional analysis. You're actually, you're actually analyzing the dimensions for, for pressure of a liquid, pressure of a fluid. Okay. Have a great day. Yeah. Let's go home. Yeah.